You might want to talk to the Don before you speak to me. Is it your habit to walk into places unannounced? Who are you? A castaway. I've come to offer you my services. A castaway? I need true men. Lucky men. You saw your ship wrecked beneath you. Do you see that as luck? When all but one other died and I lived, I call that luck. Well, I suppose we're all castaways on this island. Cast away by life, now cast away by those stones. I'll give you a chance, castaway. Prove your luck to me. I have brought you the sword you are searching for. Hmm. This is Oscar's work, I can see that right away. We both sought this sword since we heard of it. Now, here it is in my hands. Yeah. You deserve a little gold for bringing this to me. Pride gets eaten alive in this damn swamp. It gets swallowed by anger, poisoned by idleness. Sometimes I think Fincher is the only man Jack of them left with any self-worth. And Fincher told me that you have pride. But do you have substance? I am in need of pride. So I shall give you a chance to prove yourself, Castaway. If I'm to serve, I'll need better armor. Favors are earned. Prove your value and favor will follow. I'd like to know more about what's happening here. Why are you and your men in this swamp? The Inquisitor has his claws stuck deep into the flesh of this island. A firm grip on the harbor town and the monastery. Well, that's what he thinks. And that's what others see. The Inquisition's numbers growing. Men dragged into his service. What I see is a man making enemies. A man wasting his strength against the creatures in the ruins. So we wait here, the spider in the corner of the web, and we bide our time. What is the Inquisitor looking for in the temple ruins? White robes take everything they discover to the monastery. There the mages are working to unlock some secret. This much I do know. So far, they've avoided this temple. But for how much longer? Do the White Robes attack you and your men? Right now, they're avoiding open war. But if they don't find what they're searching for elsewhere, I'm sure we can expect their eyes to turn to us. What was it like before the... Corrupt, as any land ruled from the mainland. Governor after governor, bleeding the people, courting favor. When their men, the garrison, were withdrawn to the mainland, we were ready. I took control. In the name of the people, the brothels were clean, the prices fair. Men had dignity, pride. Then the earth shook, the temple ruins rode, and the Inquisition and all their ways came after them. Why here? Of all the places they could have gone, why did they come here? The Inquisitor is hiding something from us. But I shall find his secret. And in the meantime, I shall strip as much as I can from those ruins. With... What do you plan to do? I want my town back. It is our town. It belongs to the people of this island, not the mainland. For that reason, I left some of my men there when we withdrew. Gathering intelligence, frustrating the plans of the Inquisition. They were supposed to be sending me information, and I've heard little recently. These aren't times when plans run smoothly. How can I help you? Find out what is happening in Harbour Town. Find my men. I have no idea if my men are alive, in prison, dead, or worse, if they have defected. Go there. Discover the truth for me. How do I get into Harbour Town? without being seen by the Inquisition. The town's rear gate is guarded by the old town watch. They are men without a master, and their loyalty can be bought with a little gold. When everyone is corrupt, in gold you trust. What are the names of your men in Harbour Town? No, no, I don't trust you well enough for that. Go to the town and find them. And if you don't, and you are captured, 
about names that are still a chance they can stay free. I won't put my men in danger. I am willing to go to the town for you. Good. Go and find if my people are still loyal. Uh, one more thing. Yeah. The Inquisitor. Gather all the information you can about him. Here in this hole, I am deaf and blind. I have to know what that fanatic is planning. For my people. For my island. What can I do for you? Perhaps some healing? You're a mage, and you serve the dog. Someone has to take care of the boys here. It falls to me to do so. It's an honor. The boys here are a little exuberant, but I heal them, and they leave me to carry out my studies in peace. You study? Certainly. There is much to discover here. Like, for example, the magic barrier in the lower vaults. What can you tell me about the monastery? It was a place of reflection and study. Now, though, it is little more than a brutal training ground for the Inquisitor. Where one silence and thought reigned, now there is the sound of quarterstaffs clashing as the Order's warriors practice. But there are those there who remain studious, who keep the Order's knowledge. Is there anyone there who will share this knowledge? Hmm. You could try Master Iluma. He teaches scroll making. Simple magic it may be, but it would be a good idea not to underestimate the power of scrolls. Thank you. I will talk to him if I see him. I would. You won't regret it. What magic barrier? They were clever, the builders of this place. They did not rely on just iron and stone to keep people out. They knew the power of magic too. If you ever venture deeper into the temple, you'll find that out. And this isn't the only place on the island they protected with magic. What must I do to acquire the skills needed in magic? That path leads you to the harbor town. I think you should start your search for magic there. What can you offer for healing? Ah, I have potions to ease your wound. I'm well versed in the art of alchemy and prepare all potions myself. Do you have things to sell? Do not touch what is not yours. That's a lot of gold you have there. It is from the ruins. The Don's men gather it like bees. I am the bee's sting. How did an ogre wind up guarding gold for an outlaw? Don Esteban saved my life. Now I owe him that life. I, Karakos, work for Don Esteban and for my honor. The Don must trust you to leave you with all his gold. Don Esteban says, there is no one better than Caracos. Honor is what matters to me. Gold does not bring honor, only greed. Looks like the Don couldn't have found a better guard. Some people have tested Caracos. None. Past. I can believe that. The disloyal find death. The loyal I train to defend Don Esteban. You train the men here? Don Esteban needs strong arms and sharp axes. I want to improve my fighting skills. So, the Don's giving you a chance. Yes. Lucky you. Lucky me. I know what it looks like, him skulking in that temple. 
Let me give you some advice. Don't underestimate him. He's just waiting for the right time. This island is the Don's, and he's going to take it back. What do you do for the Don? I take care of things for him. Keep an eye on people. Right now, that mostly means the Inquisition, these white robes. These excavation sites are on our island. What right of the Inquisition to take everything? If you're not going to let them take you, you best get yourself some training. Are you expecting the Inquisition to attack you? They're building up their forces, pushing closer every day. It's only a matter of time before they try and overrun us. What do you mean they're taking everything? They're everywhere. A group of them even settled not far from the swamp in the southeast. They've been looting the temple ruin that shot out of the ground there. If we could capture that outpost, it would keep them off us for a little longer, give those beasts a chance to whittle down their numbers. Why haven't you captured it? Who is supposed to keep the white robes away? Brogar and his fighters. Brogar won't risk himself. Brogar is out to look after himself. He won't risk himself or his men. Hmm. And who, in your opinion, should lead his fighters? You're a big boy. You lead the attack. Looks like I'll have to. You want to prove yourself. Come to the edge of the swamp over in the south, and we'll teach the Inquisition a little lesson. If you're not all talk, I'll see you there. You wouldn't want people thinking you were a coward, would you?